Beat Saber is probably the most popular VR game, so it's unsurprising that people would want to rip it off. So today, we'll be checking out some Beat Saber clones, and at the end of this video, I'll be rating the clone that's the best Beat Saber knockoff, and the one that's the worst Beat Saber knockoff. Let's go! Alright, first up we're gonna play this game called Match Color, and it's got this kind of retro vibe going on. Play the tutorial? Using the grab button, grab the cubes and throw them towards the wall that matches the color of the cube. I don't think this is like Beat Saber. So I grab the block and then throw it? Oh. This is like interesting. Turn the volume down, bro. I wasted? I was just turning the volume down. Holy crap. Okay. All right, again, let's go hard mode. Extreme. I have no idea if this music is copyright free. So green, red, yellow, blue, red, blue, green, blue. This is kind of interesting concept to be honest. It's not quite Beat Saber, but there's blocks flying at you, so it's kind of Beat Saber. No sabers though. Wow, it's getting hard. Oh crap, oh sugar. Oh crap, okay. <laughs> okay, this game, I think, yeah, it seems like it was made cheaply. Kind of Beat Saber, it's Beat Throber. All right, new game. New so this game is called Block Hunter, and it actually looks good from the trailer. And it's an actual App Lab game. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I think this is like kawaii Beat Saber. It it's red and blue like Beat Saber. Hey, it seems like you're the block hunter. Start the tutorial? Yes. Chop the light direction and match the color. Sounds familiar. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> Great. Thank you. This is 100% Beat Saber. Awesome. Oh, it's a typo. Oh dear. <laughs> this is so funny. It looks great though. Like these sabers look cool, this environment's cool, the blocks look cool. I've got like cute little things that hype me up. Whoa, it's a wall. Whoa! Then we die. Yeah. Okay, it's like a shield. Oh, that's different. Whoa! <laughs> look at your sword handle. When the energy is full, you can take care of the bad guy. Okay. Oh, there's just like liquid in there. That's cool. Okay, look, this is actually kind of cool. Look, this is very cute, but it is blatantly Beat Saber, where they've tried to like make it cute and cartoony. I wonder if they can ever like officially release it. Hey, the music's fun. Mapping, not so good though. We've got some resets there. Oh, off beat. Off beat. Lose your point. Oh, wait, I just, oh, so when I slice, oh, okay, so that's the boss guy I gotta take down. When I slice, it's like slicing, like slices at him, like energy. Yeah, take that bad guy. That's a cool kind of like concept. That's actually really cool. Song to vibe. Hey, I got him. Yeah. There's a lot of info to learn about this game, but it's so cute. I definitely think this game's somewhat decent. Needs to work on the rhythm though. That's so cute. Well, anyway, that is Block Hunter. That was so cute. All right, next up we have Beat Bandit. And I'm pretty sure this game cost me 10 bucks, so it better be good. Bandit, okay, this is interesting. It's got a unique vibe. Oh, we got custom songs, interesting. Weapon mode, sword or a gun? Mate, I can't pick anything. Hello? I can't select anything. Oh, okay, I did something. This game's already getting low in the ratings because it doesn't work. Oh, okay, I have one saber. Oh, yes, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, okay. Everything's green. I don't know what the arrows are. Wrong. What do I do with red? Maybe I should have watched the instructions. <laughs> instructions. Uh, look, that's a lot of reading and I've read it and I still don't understand it. So let's just YOLO this. Beat bandit. Look, the music's all right. That's one redeeming factor. And the blocks are like kind of to the music. Kind of. That is. <laughs> Look, it's kind of got a vibe. And the environment's cool. Look, the mapping is like, it's on beat, but uh, definitely doesn't have like any flow. And I don't get the point of these red blocks. There you go. That is Beat 
band it with a menu system that doesn't work very well. But apart from that, do not recommend. What other games do we have? All right, next up I have Saber Do ABC. And it's what you think it is, I think. It's like Beat Saber, but with educational elements. At least we have some sabers. Although I feel like this environment has like put me back into like the 90s. Oh, we, so we have to spell the word dog? <laughs> What do I have to do? Oh, I failed. Okay. <laughs> uh, so there's letters flying at me. They're up very high though. Okay, I failed again. <laughs> I don't understand. What do I do? I can spell, okay. I swear I can spell. I want a D, dog. Give me a D. That's a D. Oh, I matched the colors. Okay, so I match the colors. W. W. I. Okay, floor's fixed. Okay, it's a D. Give me the D, w. not that D. Give me an O. I'm stubborn and I'm gonna spell this damn word if it's the last thing I do. All right, W. w. It's not working. God damn. <laughs> hey, this game. What is this sound? The drone sound and this happy music. I feel like I'm in some hellscape where you like can't leave until you spell a word. Okay, I don't, I don't know if I can stand this any any moment. This is definitely not. A good game. <laughs> what other games do we have? Whoa! <laughs> this is cool. A Christmas. It's Christmas. How cool. Oh my god. What is he doing? Minecraft. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah, this is so cool. Oh my god. Yeah. This is so neat. Look at this. And like the debris lands on the ground. Look at this. Look at this. This is, this is great. And I got a cute doggy hyping me up. Hi, doggy. Oh, that baby. And look, they, the debris falls everywhere. Oh, what is this? What is this? And that pills, like the ma matrix. Whoa. Yeah, I should play this in my living room. Next game. All right, the next game I want to play is one I surprisingly haven't played before. And that's Moon Rider, which is a web XR program. So, which means you just have to open up the browser on your quest and you can either type in moonrider.xyz or uh, it usually just shows up with a bunch of like WebXR games you can play straight away. And I've heard this game is like pretty much Beat Saber. Here to enter VR. Whoa, this looks cool. It's not like pastel. Look at our little Saber things that look like PlayStation controllers. Let's begin. Help me, savior. What song won't get me demonetized? This is a pretty big music list, to be honest. If you're hearing different music now, you know I've been demonetized. What do I do? Punch them. What is this? Where's my savers gone? Definitely like Beat Saber. But without the savers. Looks cool, like visually, it's really nice. It's like when you're like, Mom, can I have Beat Saber? It's like, no, we got Beat Saber at home. You load up Moon Rider. Oh, punch mode. Oh, I didn't realize. Okay, there's punch mode. I want classic mode. All right, this is actual Beat Saber this time. Here we go. Oh, I have no haptics though. All right, this uh, mapping's kind of gone out the window. Oh my God, the mapping. No, no, it's terrible. <laughs> I'm sorry whoever mapped this, but it's not on beat. Well, here you go, Moon Rider. If you've got a quest, in moonrider.xyz, there's a ton of songs in there. You may not 100% be legal, but if you want to play them, check it out. Beat Saber's better, right? But this is free, so you can't complain. All right, ignore my sweaty VR face, but we need to award the best and the worst clone. So first of all, I think we need to award the best game, and I'm gonna go with... Block Hunter. Like that game, actually really cute. Like it was like a ripoff of Beat Saber, but they kind of did their own spin. And it's a very like polished, cutesy game. Uh, and I think if anyone like paid for that, they'd probably enjoy it. So it had like kind of weird aspects to it. Like, and there were typos. So can't have those typos. I wish like the mapping was a bit better, but that was really cute. I like that one. But what about the worst Beat Saber knockoff? I'm gonna go with Beat Bandit. <laughs> I mean, it was kind of a ripoff, but it just was wasn't particularly well done. And I always respect developers when they spend their time to like make these games, but if you're gonna rip off a really popular game, you wanna do it well. Uh, and that one was just weird, like had controller issues. It was only one saber and like the mapping was eh. So that gets the award for worst Beat Saber clone, I'm afraid.
afraid. But anyway, I had fun checking out all these Beat Saber clones. I've got a ton more I want to check out, which I may save for another video, so let me know if you want that. Uh, but don't forget to write banana in the comments if you watched all the way through, and I'll see you next time. Bye!